Sometimes boxing gives us the most unlikely of rivalries. Today, I am joined by Florian Marku, the Albanian king, and the real deal, Dylan Moran. They go head to head, and they will go head to head on September 2nd. You, 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 you save me the talk. No, no, you pull this high. You save yeah. me the hair, man. Talk. What is it? Acting like you're a bird. You were a bird, but you know by looking at me, you've got a point in it. What is that? Mm. Exams. Um. Florian, Dylan, thanks for joining me. This is a fight that has uh, a lot of attention on it. It's been billed as one to watch, a clash of styles. Dylan, I'll come to you first. How did this fight come around for you? No more than a phone call, John Foy Florian. I was like, yeah, you know, let's go. Signed the dotted line and here we are. Florian, did you ask for Dylan? I didn't really know who Dylan is. <laughs> to tell you the truth, uh, before he was calling me out, then uh, when he they put my name uh, his name on the on the thing i saw him and i saw he he write at me a mess and hey man after you last uh, uh, when you beat this guy we need to fight next you know and then when was when i answered to him because this fight was supposed to fight in june I think June the first year banks yeah yeah, yeah. and uh, I say to him because they told me he needed more time that he said no I don't have much time and I say to him listen this chance come once in lifetime he to fight me talking to me like he was Mayweather this is your last chance listen, to fight me you got some ideas about yourself I'm speaking mm -hmm. when she speak will then. ask you yeah. you speak yeah go on then and uh, you and uh, yeah I tell to him listen this is the fight that if you fight, if you don't fight, you, you, this chance never gonna happen again. I said, he said, yeah, but I'm not really fit. Uh, I had the injury. I am sick and blah blah blah. What do you tell him, Lois? Okay, I say. Hey, what are you lying for? Nobody was sick. What you told? I told you I moved home from Germany. I had no time to train. I got a new trainer. This just shows I wasn't taking the fight. You know, I was taking it seriously. Same thing. No, I don't remember. I, I don't remember no exactly injury. what he's saying. I'm not. I'm not fit. Mm -hmm. With small words. Okay. I'm not fit to fight you and I need more time. I say, this is the time that we fight, you know? Otherwise, we don't, we, we will not fight. And then the fight was postponed. They give me a date for the first of, uh, when Dalton Smith, my, uh, my teammate was fighting and uh, I accepted, but we couldn't fight because it was the same, same day like uh, uh, Dalton. And we keep forward and then they give me again the fight with him. They they gave him the offer. He accepted the fight, and here we are now, second of September. Dylan, you you wanted this fight. You chased it for for a long time. It seemed. Why Florian? What do you see in Florian that you can exploit? Florian's got the name. You know, there's no denying he doesn't. These are the guys you need to fight, and it was not more than that. Basically, in 2021, I was just sitting and watch his fights. And I said, he's in my weight division, you know, we need to fight. You know, you need to make these fights happen and I'm glad that it's here. Now that we are here, I'm guessing you've had a, a look at Dylan. What do you think of his skills? What do you think of him as a fighter? In my life, I have been fighting 17 years. I beat guys in MMA, in kickboxing, in boxing, outside. People like this guy up that try to, 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 to offend me and does me, show me disrespect you know this guy is not different why is not different because i dedicate i sacrifice my life maybe he he sacrificed these two three months for this fight with florian because for him this fight is his world title fight but for me all my life every fight every training every sparring is my world title fight and day you understand and that's the different me with him i don't disrespect him i know he have he will be in the 2nd of September the best Dylan Moran that have ever been in his whole career. But that is not enough to beat me with the help of God. You know, I have a lot in me and we're going to show that on the 2nd of September. All the other is bullshit. Whatever he say or what I say now is uh, nonsense. Dylan, you are a, a pure boxer, a southpaw. You've got a style that can give anybody problems. Mm. When he says that you know, the best version of you will not beat the best version of him. <clears throat> what are your thoughts? Yeah, look, I can give it the, the hard man story of hindering and ordering. We've all done that. You know, there's no point sitting here 
We're singing off the same sheet all the time. Like I said, if your hands were as good as your mouth, you'd be world champion already. But you're not. No worries. Mm. I'm not retired. <laughs> I will be. Yeah, we'll see. Exactly. We'll see. But nobody can knock me out. D listen, you sell tickets. Yeah. This is a business. Mm -hmm. You bring money to the table. That's yeah. why you're being minded. You know what I mean? Second of September, I'm upsetting the apple cart. I bring. I understand you. Yes, but listen, in my life. In my life. Yeah, go on. Okay. You have a hard life. I've heard it all no, before. No, no, no. Okay, you keep going and then yeah. when you finish I will I will because I don't like to make like girls girls yeah, interrupt each on. other and blah blah blah. Yeah, yeah. Speak go and on. then I speak. I said we've all had hard lives. Yeah. Go around the corner, there's people homeless on the street. Me and you haven't got the right to talk about having a hard yeah. life being sat here. Yeah, I want to mm. say something else. Go then. Bro. Nobody ever beat me that had two wins, two losses, mm. four throws and to knock me out. I have never in my life been knocked out mm. like you did with some mm. shit opponent. Me, I am different like him and like all the past your opponents, you understand? I don't underestimate you. I wake up today in the morning, 5 o'clock, I run, I go to the gym, boxing, 7. I, come the, I took the car and I drive to London. Nice. You think I underestimate you? I don't underestimate no one because I respect <laughs> myself and everyone who steps in the ring with me I see him like someone who tried to stop me from reaching my dreams. No, th no, that I care about you. I don't care about no one, but I care about me and stepping in the ring and mm. not fulfilling my dreams. That is about you. Understand? No, I understand. As a thing. And the same. I'm not sitting here saying Florian isn't a good fighter. No. He's not tough. He's not strong. He's not explosive. He doesn't work hard because he is all those things. But I am sitting here saying I don't care. Yeah. Mm. Good, very good. I know you don't care because if you was caring, you was going sitting down on the table now, you know? Yeah, it was no, not no, coming no, to me care. face face to face yeah. and uh, get in the interview. But yeah, we're, we're similar in if, ways. Uh, if you should make me gift <laughs> and you, mu you must say to me 100 times, Florian Margo, thank you because I put you in that position now to stay in front of me, in front of this camera. <laughs> he's talking like he's McGregor now. No, no, let me yeah. talk. Let me talk. Save it, bro. What no position? Worries. No worries. Let me talk. You've got some mad ideas about yourself. What have you done? What have you done? Answer it now for the camera. What, take away your fancy TikTok videos, your cameraman, and what have you done? Nothing. I, I have what have you done? I, I should do, do, yeah, do I'm waiting. I'm waiting. Yeah. What have you done? No I, more than I have. Do you want to what you, Yeah, what, what have you done? Yeah. Listen. I, I, I try to go, go. Yeah. I beat like you in whatever style do you want mm. 150 people yeah. never ever someone yeah. knock me out yeah I beat people yeah. in out cage whatever you want you understand but in the 2nd of September when you're gonna be and you're gonna see me Face to oh, face yeah, I'm like I'm looking at you now. With me, exactly. Yeah, yeah. yeah exactly. Like, I've because like now, before. now we cannot do nothing. We cannot no, see course, each other like this course. two hours, three hours. Nothing gonna happen, you understand? Yeah. Then you're gonna see if I'm different or not. Now it's nonsense if I play tough or you play tough or you're talking big and what I did and what you do. You see who I am and what I do. Second of September. I'm not in a position to talk about records. Miguel exactly. Para robbed in Albania. A joke, the referee was a joke, the whole thing was a fix, he was probably a cousin of yours. The man got robbed, blind. Ryan Charlton, Horrid Lewis set up, two lightweights, paid good money to come up. Chris Jenkinson, one could argue, was past his best. Give you a good win, pro Dan, in my opinion, betcha, my opinion, good fight. So, there's nobody levels above anyone here flying. There's no European titles. You're carrying on like you're undisputed world champion. But you're not. Mm -hmm. You're far from it. Mm -hmm. mm. Dylan. Okay, sorry. Go. I'm sorry. Go for it. All that that you say are so beautiful to hear. Mm. The crowd here, they are so nice. After I beat you, what you gonna say? I have done this question again to Ryland Charlton, the bodybuilder. Now I'm talking to you. After I'm gonna beat you, mm. and you mention all this name, what you gonna say? Well, first of all, you have to do it. And if you do, Florian, the same as all the time, I shake a hand and I say, well done. That's good. Mm. Very nice. That's what I'll do. Florian's obviously boxed, you know, on this stage before, mm. bigger profile, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. But you have the opportunity to dethrone him and, and you know take some of that profile. Does how that opportunity gonna, how's he gonna dethrone me? Run away for uh, twelve rounds? How? Well, let's ask. What kind of no, fight I do you imagine? I, I'm gonna tell you. Go She's gonna try to Story run. Time. She's gonna try to run for twelve rounds around the ring, trying to outbox me. And after two, three rounds. 
she was not getting tired. And you're the one going to show. She's going to show off the heart because you can train all your life. You can train five hours when you are in there with someone who is willing to die to win. Then the legs start getting shaky. And we see who have more shaky legs in there. Yeah. I'm going to remind you. If you put him no behind cow. the curtain where you can't see him, you think he's seven foot tall. No, no, yeah. no, no, I'm not tall. I'm not tall. I am 174. I'm not tall. But this is much taller than what you have ever seen in all your life this yeah. year. Yeah. That is yeah. It. <clears throat> the point. Florian, do you envision a fight where you have to, to hunt Dylan? Do you feel like he'll be on the back foot and just try and box to a, a, a decision victory? I think that he will try to do that because he will not have other way. Let's, let's, let's be honest, everyone. You know, she will try to, she's a good boxer, really good amateur boxing. Everybody knows, you know, about, about, about him. And she will try to keep me away with his job. And then Florian will go inside and bam, bam, <laughs> two punches. Yeah. KO. Yeah. What kind of fight are you expecting? He, he gonna remind that KO that he, he was getting, you know, because he will have some nightmares after me. Nightmares. You're full of it, aren't you? Yeah, I have, many, I have many about my life. Oh, yeah. yeah. I have, that's why I say, I know when... I, when You're when, a very child. I know, I know, I, when, I know when nightmares come. I, I have many. nightmares about you. Trust me, I've seen the likes of you all my life. A little man with a big attitude. No. Mm. You're going to see again once more on 7th of September. Dylan, where is this fight won and lost for you? If the training's done, it's just about me turning up on the night and being the best till the morning. And I believe that's good enough to be Florian. Obviously, Florian is going to be the best Florian in Mark group. And yeah, it is being billed as boxer against puncher. I think it's an exciting fight. And like I said, I'm looking forward to it. Does recent activity come into it? Florian's obviously not fought in a year. Do you feel like this is the best time to catch him? Yeah, look, I know we're having a bit of back and forth. I'm not going to sit here and run him down. I know he lives the life. I know he's dedicated. <clears throat> I know I've got my homework done on him just as much as he has on me. So yeah, could inactivity play a part? Maybe so, but I'm not banking on it. Florian, sometimes you've been accused of maybe losing some concentration or perhaps even getting bored in fights and, and making them maybe more difficult than they have to be. Good point. Can you avoid doing that this time and must you avoid doing that in order to get the win? You know, my trainer, Grant Smith, you know how he's calling me in the gym? Loco. He say, you're crazy. You give away rounds because you say, oh, it's okay. Nothing, nothing, uh, nothing happens. And that's the problem because not getting lazy, but getting uh, more confident. I'm going, I, I, I will say to, you know, and letting rounds go like, uh, but now it's completely different. You know, I've been in this one year out of boxing. Whoever lives a life of boxing knows how hard it is. <laughs> and for me, it was really hard. And now I'm, now I'm back and thanks God I've changed many things. I had a lot of time to, to relax, to think, to spend time with my family. Now I have a boy, now I have also a, one baby girl, two months. And I'm really happy. Nobody, with the help of God, gonna take that away from me. You know, the good life that I'm gonna provide them. Not him, but not five like him in the ring. The only way that he can do that, you know what is? to knock me out unconscious because if he doesn't knock me out unconscious and I'm seeing, like I'm saying, and I'm talking, then it's very hard, very, very hard. Do you think that Mexican lost that fight in your homecoming? He punched you from pillar to post for 10 rounds. What is Miguel pillar? Para. What is pillar to post? Four post corners of the ring, yeah. the Mexican punched you. Nobody yeah. Nobody ever Florian. post me. Stop. <laughs> if you know boxing, watch the fight. You said you had one hand, you had two hand. Listen, no There's no denying. Okay. So nobody has to knock you out. You are outboxed by a Mexican with no jab. You, you, you're friend with, uh, with a Mexican? No, no. Okay. No, 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 because I want to know no, what, no. What, what to say. Maybe I say to him, no, hi, I just, know, I, just, I just know what I've seen. Okay. You uh, won, you got the decision, mm -hmm. but nobody I, has to knock you out. You're outboxed in that fight. And I believe pro Dan beat you as well. Okay, and then, you're getting gifted the decisions yeah, then, because then, you bring money to the table. Yeah, this is a business. Then, then you my, played my, a part well, fair play to you. Then you're my, a good talker. Then you're my, a good fighter. Mm -hmm. mm. Then my father is the owner of Sky Sports and they give me fights like this. You know? so, <laughs> Who knows? Maybe so, but, maybe so. Who knows? You understand? You that maybe. Know. Yeah, but listen, that's why I said before mm. that you should say to me, thank you. 
that you bring me in this. Doesn't yeah, matter you. how I bring you. Yeah. Maybe my father is the head of <laughs> Sky Sport, or maybe uh, my my ticket selling, or my maybe my fighting, or doesn't matter. But yeah, you are here in this table and in these cameras because of me. This man got to with you. Dylan, because when me, nobody was going to fight you. When you look at Florian's last fight, does that give you confidence that you can get on top of him and you can box him? But also, with that being said, you, you've mentioned it, you believe he gets some decisions that you probably wouldn't have given him. How decisively do you have to beat him? All I want is a fair decision. I believe the Mexican beat him. It was a good fight. You know what I mean? He's saying you have to knock out the beat. The Mexican beat you, in my opinion. Like I said, all I want is a fair decision on the night. Florian, how do you win this fight? Give me a prediction. I say before he gonna try to run for the two rounds, three rounds, and then I'm gonna stick to him, and I'm gonna make him pay for whatever words he say in front and of me. And then he gets tired. And I'm gonna who get tired? You, me? Yeah. Okay, yeah. here. In which you, you give a little, I speak? You give, you give a little here, attack, and then you walk off from him. He minute. said You're good at that, that I'm gonna be tired. Then you complain three the referee. Rounds. We're going to see inside yeah. of the ring who is going to be tired and what is going to happen. And like I say, he's he going to try to outbox me and I'm going to stop him. I'm going to stop him in a more spectacular way that this guy uh, uh, stop him and knock it down. And uh, in back of his head, he thinks about that. He says, Florian, maybe does that to me. But he's going to see it <laughs> and he's going to feel that. He's not going to only imagine that. He's going to see and he's going to feel it. And I'm very happy we are here. I know he also is happy because we are here and this, uh, this publicity, he have never experienced something like this. Till 2 of September, he's going to enjoy it. After 2 of September, he's going to regret it. Dylan, you've got a very confident Florian in front yeah, of you. Same script. How does, how does this fight go for you? I believe it's going to be a hard fight. I'm not saying it's easy by no means, but I believe that I have everything it takes to be flying in Marco. You know, he comes forward, he looks for the punch. I'm just not going to be there. Um, I'm going to make him meet his words on September 2nd. Anything else you'd like to get off your chest? Yeah, you know, I know we've had the back and forth. I do have respect for flying. I hope we make it out of the fight safe and sound and go on to our families healthy. And yeah. it'll be a job well done. Yeah. Guys, it's been a pleasure. Do we get a handshake? Yeah. Good luck to both of you. Of course. I am not like the guys that you met in your life. Yeah. 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 The things yeah. get personal. Save me, me the hard man. No respect. Sorry. Me, I respect. <coughs> Save. Yeah. I don't give a Save the hard man. Save it. Save it. Me Save, me exactly. Save me the hard man. Holds no weight here. No worries. You're not gonna bully anyone today or in the ring. Exactly. Yeah. You understand that? September. No worries. We're gonna see you. Save the talk. Save the talk. you don't. If your hands were as good as your mouth, most of the people. People told already. me that you pull out. Yeah, exactly. Does no one pulling out? Does it look like I'm pulling out? I hope so. Does it look like I'm pulling out? I hope so. Mm. I Open your eyes, so. I'm sorry, I'm funded. Guys, we just have a big silence for 10 seconds before we start. <coughs> Please. Yeah, is it just cut through the cameras. Uh, no, no, the I swear, because they told me many things that you're pulling out and I've never pulled I'm going to have a problem fighting. You know, need them both in the intro. Short, no, All right, give me a second. Before, my life. Okay. Ever. That's I don't great. know who you've been talking to. Okay. I'll be there September 2nd. Oh. Don't worry. Thank you. Yeah. I appreciate that. Yeah. I appreciate I'll, that. I'll be there. Because oh, no they told me that. And I'm afraid because I've been training all this. You said you got up Did I, I started by saying... 3 o'clock in Ireland. I'm not here to joke around.